Hey guys, I'm just here to update you on my growth. Um, I have <laughs> quite a surprise for you guys today. Um, as you can see, the lulo I was trying to grow from seed sprouted. There's three there. And here's one here. So these are the ones here that I started in a Ziploc bag and in a wet towel. So that is proven to be the better way. After they sprouted, I planted them, which gave it a lot more chance of survival than this one, where only one of them came out of the dirt, which is kind of disappointing. Um, I'm thinking maybe the dirt is too compact and the seeds just weren't able to sprout out of the dirt. My best guess. <clears throat> Uh, seeing as these took forever to sprout. They took probably three weeks to sprout. So they're slow growing plants. They're definitely not the fast kind of growing plants like peppers or anything like that. Um, I'll show you later, but in the I still have uh, three or four more seeds from the Ziploc uh, bag that have sprouted also. So I will be planting them in here. <clears throat> the reason why is because Check it out. This is the pepper plant. Let me see if I get this to focus. That is the pepper plant. Look how miserable it looks. Something happened to where the leaf, the leaves, um, shriveled up. And it looks like, honestly, it looks like it's not going to make it. Uh, which is okay, since I wasn't intentionally, intending on uh, growing another pepper plant. Uh, but, um... Kind of sad about it, but you know, I tried. I give it some. I give it a chance. I don't think it's gonna make it, but I'll see it a few more days to see if it shrivels up even more than it's for sure dead. And I'm gonna go ahead and plant my three or four other lulo sprouts inside here. And those should make uh, at least three of those should be able to make it. So in total, I will have. Well, in total, right now I have four four lulo sprouts. This one here, I'm afraid for this one. This one here on the corner. I don't know if it's going to make it because the seed, the hard seed casing is still surrounding the leaves. And it looks like the leaves might not be strong enough to break out of that shell. And if that's the case, it will die. And it's not because of how small it is, there's no way I can surgically remove that seed head. I mean, I could try, but it'll probably end up killing him anyway. So I'm just going to leave him and see if he can make it. I don't think he will because that shell head has been stuck on there for a while. Um, in that case, I will only have three sprouts. And then my um, ceiling here. Um, I've been giving him more light, artificial light. But look at the leaves, how it's getting patchy. I'm a little worried about this leaf here. It seems like maybe... Um, Maybe it's not going to make it. I mean, these this leaf is not looking good at all. Um, these new leaves, though. Let me show you these new leaves. These new leaves are looking great. There's two there. And there's one here. So there's three new leaves. Now, these three new leaves started growing out. Um, the other two leaves look fine. This one looks fine. And this one, it's it came this way, all tattered like this. Um, but that one actually doesn't look as degraded as this one. I don't know why, but this one's getting all patchy. What I my, my best guess is that the roots have already. You can you can see how the roots are like compacted on the bottom, and that's suffocating it. So, I will be transplanting it to a bigger container ASAP, probably tonight, um, and that should be able to give it some more space to grow out. All right, that's the update, guys. I'll, I'll keep you guys updated on everything else. Um, I'm really honestly surprised that these seedlings actually came out of the dirt because it was a long time. And these aren't even trees. They're just bushes, and it take that long. I don't know. Um, I don't know. I guess it's just a slow-growing plant. So I'll keep you guys updated. Okay, see ya.